Good morning, welcome back to my channel, welcome back to my den. I'm Rosalba, a new illustrator and writer of children's books uh, in the UK. In my previous video I was talking to you about how I had messed up uh, one of my paintings. I wanted to, I was trying to depict a night scene or a sunrise and instead everything became very muddy and unclear and not attractive at all. So if you come closer, I'll show you what the painting was like before. I was trying to um, show that um, these two creatures were arriving at a particular place and, um, and instead the background scene with them sort of they look as if they are in the same um, in the same place you don't really see dimensions you don't see the land far away it's all very muddy and confusing so I decided to scrap it all and start from the beginning um, so I'll show you what I came up with afterwards I changed the scene a little bit so that I could show the distance like the perspective was better there or it's better the trees i thought would point towards the land where they're heading to and um and then the characters are more have darker colors it's almost like a silhouette but not quite and um and the foreground is really really dark again showing that transition of dark where the shade is uh, because the sun is rising from from here so all the shade or the shadows are on the foreground um, and then the light is, is coming here um, so I wasn't sure how to do that and one of the things I had to do was do some research so I went on YouTube and came across a lovely artist called Jana Watercolors and I'll show you how he was painting hopefully it's quite clear again he I could see he was he mm -hmm. yeah. the, I'll just clear so the foreground as well. was quite dark which is what I tried to do with my creatures I put the creatures on a, in, on a mountain on a cliff which is quite dark and then um, the light towards the um, the middle or um, end of the uh, watercolor paper representing the light of the sunrise so he used a lot of yellows I used Windsor yellows mainly and then he did use some purples to depict the night and he used a lot of red to be able to achieve that dark color which I did so I do recommend that if it's a night scene that you're interested in painting or achieving to check him out I will put his link in the description below for you to have a look and um, and yes so that's how um, I achieved this I hope that you would agree that this is much better a much better representation of what I was trying to achieve compared to this and um, and also, you know, hopefully you will see that we mustn't be afraid to discard a painting if it isn't working and then try a new one. And I hope that you would agree that this is, a, this is much better. Um, so anyway, I hope you enjoyed seeing the transition from this to this. And if you did, please subscribe to my channel and um, so that I can, you know, you can come and visit me in my den and, and I'll see you soon again. So thank you for watching. Bye-bye.